if this is your first uh, escape uh, reviewing of me, let me go ahead and give you the rundown. Other one is Tamika. Latako or Latocha is Latasha. 411 is Tiny and Crybaby Distress is Candy Barres. Just for clarity's sake. All right, escape. Let me um, try to get y'all this right quick. I got like five minutes, so I got to be inside. So Crybaby Distress and Tan. Crybaby Distress is what I'll be calling Candy Barres um, for the duration of until I feel like I'm going to stop. Um, and Tan. Tan was a, a, an original member of Escape. I remember her uh, slightly from um, just seeing her around, not from the group or anything, but seeing her around or whatever. Tan is, she's been tacky the whole time, I feel like, but okay, girl. <laughs> she and Crybaby get together and commiserate and discuss how everything is horrible and it's, it's down with Escape. And I'm just like, girl, well, don't be a part. Do the BET Awards, do the little yada, 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 and then go. But now y'all on this tour. So if I pay these tickets for this tour and get there and y'all acting a fool, swear to God, I'm going to beat y'all. Swear to God, I'm going to get up on that stage as fast as I'm going to do a Bianca on Love and Hip Hop and uh, evade the security, walk up there and whoop some tail. Promise I am. Y'all better get up there and y'all better stand there contemplating on the right thing to decide. You better take the right direction. Shut off on me, but y'all better take the right direction all your life. Um. Anyway, they commiserating. Um, then they go into how... Uh, Latako's husband, Rocky, helped her, hyped her up basically into thinking that she should be a solo artist. Now, in theory, Latako has a wonderful voice and she probably could have been a solo artist, but something about Latako just doesn't click as a solo artist. She at least needs to be a Mary Mary duet with a sister. <laughs> something. Um, and Candy was talking about, you know, Latako didn't want to, she didn't want to be in the dressing room with us, and she didn't want to sit with us, and she didn't want to pray with us. And I said, dang, Latako, you didn't want to pray with her. You want to pray with the girls. Lord Jesus. Um, and what I don't understand about all of this is how is it that Latako was the, the, the big separating force, and she didn't want to be with everybody, but it's Candy that didn't want to come back together and reform the group. That doesn't make sense to me, but okay. Um... 411 wants to talk before rehearsal. 411 would be tiny. She wants to talk. She calls everybody, you know, excuse me, can I have a room for me? You know, all of that. She gets the room for a moment, um, and the moment is a lot longer than she thought it was going to be. But the girls get there, and Crybaby don't want her name on the paperwork, and yada, yada, and they doing all of this and that. And Lataco says the fans are involved, and we got to, you know, this ain't just about us. It's about the fans. And I said, you are damn right, because if I pay these tickets... These prices for these tickets, y'all hoes better get up there and y'all hoes better sing for the gods. Y'all better get up there and, you know, <laughs> feel so good. It better be, <laughs> child, you better put on a doggone show. Um, I turn to find your way. <laughs> I promise. Anyway, child, um, Candy talks about how, excuse us, their um, third album was supposed to be a setup for Latako's solo album. And Latako's like, girl, no, it wasn't. And Candy's like, the lawyer came to us and said you wouldn't be singing if we didn't put out the, the third. If, if, if you didn't get your album. Something, child. She wouldn't sing on the third album if she didn't get her solo album. And I was like, girl, what is you talking about? And can uh, 411, Tiny, finally got up there and was like, yeah, your lawyer did kind of say something like that. <laughs> and she's like, I ain't no nothing about what in the world. And so Candy is finally like, thank you. And I'm just like, girl, I don't have time. Um... Let's see. Other one, because they, they tried to get other one to pipe in. Other one was like, uh-uh, child, don't put me in this. I'm not involved. I ain't got nothing to do with it. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> when she when she said she wasn't involved, I was like, I see what's up. I see that there's a sisterhood that doesn't extend to a couple of them, which, you know, that's fine, I guess. But I, I'm the type of person that I value my biological sisters and I value, you know, my god sisters, my play sisters the same. I don't, there's no differentiating with me. It's, if you my sister, you are my sister. That's it. That's all. You get on my nerves, we'll stop talking for a little while, but then we come back and you my sister. There are only, there have only been two girls that I've considered a sister that I no longer consider a sister out of the thousands of girls that call me sis. So, but anyway, let me run here to work and I'll catch up with the rest of this in a little bit. All right, so I'm on my bank run and I can continue with what I was saying, which is, um... Like, it's one thing to be loyal to your sister. It's another thing to be messy boots. And the other one is messy boots. We're going to get more into that in just a moment. <laughs> I'm in the middle of uh, backing up. And I don't like to be too, too distracted while I'm doing that. Because this is a busy little road here. Let me get back to my notes. So anyway. Um, other one. 
took it upon herself. And it, now, other one is over there on her confessional talking about she was lying on Candy in defense of her sister. And I'm just like, why you couldn't just stop talking to Candy? Why you have to spread fallacies on the girl? Why you couldn't just say, you know what, I, I'm signing with my sister. I can't excommunication. Like, why would you get up there and talk about she was sleeping with Jermaine Dupree and carrying on? I could, I, I just truly, there was not anything that could bother me in that moment. I could not be bothered for this. Um, so when they get through with their giant meeting and carrying on, the band is gone. Just completely and totally gone. You miss it. So the band left and Latocha wants to uh, have a conversation with Crybaby. And it was a very big sister, little sister conversation. I've had plenty of these conversations with my big sisters and my little sisters where it's just like, girl, I was feeling this way. Why didn't you see it? And then the little sister, I mean, the big, whoever, whichever sister, it's just like, I, I didn't see it. I don't know. And they move on from there. Um, they cried, child, and I just couldn't be bothered with the tears. And, uh, you know, Lataco said, you know, I, I looked out for you, Candy. I felt like you were my little sister. And, you know, I looked out and blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, well, why, why Candy don't feel it? Then they start talking about Patrick, God rest him. Patrick, as we all know, is uh, Candy's older brother that passed away when she was 14. I believe he was 22. He died in a car crash, and, you know, it was a very troubling time. Riley is named after Patrick and all of that. Um, Patrick was the mediator. If Patrick was still alive, the group probably would still be going strong, or, you know, they would have lasted a lot longer than they did. Uh, so God rest Patrick. Um, so the girls get up there the next day, and they sing, and, and they give, you know, as I stand here contemplating <laughs> on the right thing to the wrong thing, wrong thing to decide. Yeah, I better not. <laughs> I better not because I just realized that um, I'm a little sketchy with the words. It's been a while. Um, anyway, they still sound good, and um, Crybaby and the Taco join forces. They join forces for the set list for BET. They want to keep it under four minutes. And they do just that, so it's wonderful. Um, apparently, Michael Jackson loved understanding, and I said this is very important information to me because I also love understanding. Um, let's see. Other one got two daughters. The oldest daughter did, but she looks a lot like other one. So I'm going to call her other one's little one, and the other other one is other one's little one's little, 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 little one. I don't know. The children. Hold on. So oh, anyway, child... The oldest of other ones, little ones, is uh, getting married. Let me wait for this fire truck. Getting married and, um, you know, other one is excited about it. And then she calls on the littlest of the other ones. And I think her name is Tania, Tania, to, to somebody, child. Mm, they're going into my life. Who on fire over here? Nobody? Nobody. The honey baked ham ain't on fire. Anyway, um... Girl, if you don't turn up in this joint so I can turn... Oh, wait. <laughs> Let me not. That time it was me. Anyway, girl. So, other one's daughter's getting married. The other one won't do the dishes. It's the gist of the whole <laughs> little point. She writing songs and carrying on. I was like, okay, so you hyping up her song writing and her, her talent. With your lady. Five, six, seven, eight. Give us a ditty. Come on. I'm ready. I want to hear it. So, I hope we get to hear the child uh, give us a, a, a vocal ability. Um, Let's see. Her husband, the other one's husband, uh, she let him go out the house with ashy elbows. And I said, oh. Oh. <laughs> anyway, child, uh, they trying to dance. Candy can't dance, yada, yada, yada. Um, then we swoop over to Zanique. That's my girl. Bless her heart. She's just, just a little bit boring, but that's still my girl. I love me some Zanique. Um, and she's perform you know, practicing for her performance. She'll be doing BET, and her parent will be doing BET as well. Come on, Mary Kay Consultant, baby. I got to get in, in, in this parking space. Um, so that's cute. And it's a cute little moment with uh, Tiny and her, her child. Moving along from that, uh, they singing, Who can I run to to fill this empty face with laughter? <laughs> and I'm saying, like, you in Escape and you don't know the words is empty space. Lord Jesus. <laughs> she said she's been singing empty face for 24 years. And I said, my God, today. Well, not 25. I think. I think Who's Can I Run To was on the second album. Or it was on the last album, wasn't it? I don't know, child. Anyway, she's been singing Face for, the, for low this many years. And uh, she just found out it was Face. Um, let me see. Joyce pops in. 
and uh, she greets the girls. And it was interesting to me that Mama Joyce would hug other one who got on the radio and lied about Candy sleeping with Jermaine Dupree. Lied about Candy sleeping with, with Jermaine Dupree, but won't hug Phaedra, won't talk to Phaedra, and went all up in garb trying to get the scoop on Phaedra and her divorce. That's strange to me. That's very strange. Because if the reason you don't like Candy is because... I mean, Phaedra is because Candy lied. I mean, God, Jesus, today, today because <laughs> Phaedra lied on Candy or did all this whatever to Candy. You should not like other one as well, because Tamika did get on the radio and lie about it and just got on TV and said she lied about it. So, but anyway, child, um, she proceeds to tell the girls, y'all don't need to be doing all that dancing. Let somebody else do all that sweating and y'all just sang. Y'all are singers. And they said, true. Candy was like, amen, amen, because I can't dance. <laughs> And everybody was just like, yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> so hopefully they won't give us all these moves on the tour, honey. Give us a, you know, a, uh, 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 uh. Who can I run to? Uh, uh. Fill this empty face with laughter. Who can I run to? Uh. When I need just a quick little, a little ditty. You don't need to give us too, too much. Not too, too much. Just a shimmy, a shimmy, and a rock. Uh, 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 a shimmy. I don't know what I'm doing. I need to get back to work. Anyway, <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe. All the things that YouTubers say. And I'm going to come back to y'all with the next escape uh, video next week. So, hope y'all enjoyed it. Hope y'all stayed more than the five minutes <laughs> that the girls stay on my videos. These analytics are terrible. But anyway, y'all, I'll see you.